So I created a new React app and just a disclaimer, this is not a React Redux beginner series. So I expect you to already know how to create a new React app. And I did some cleanup. I removed all the CSS files because we will be using Bootstrap to style our components and uh, several inline styling. So we won't be needing any extra CSS files. And also I'm just returning a React fragment and a HD in our app.js. So if I go to the browser, uh, this is the only thing that we are returning. So let's install Bootstrap so that we can use it to style our different components. And to do that, I will go to uh, CMD. I'll be using a uh, command prompt to install all the packages that I'll be needing. But you, you can use uh, Visual Studio Terminal to do the same. So it's just your choice. So right here, I will type npm i short for install and then bootstrap and then press enter and this will install uh, the bootstrap package in our application now that bootstrap is installed i'll go back to our text editor and then i will go to index.js and i will import bootstrap css here so import bootstrap forward slash dist forward slash css forward slash bootstrap dot css so i will save that file and go to our app.js and i want to test out that uh, bootstrap is actually working so in our h3 i will add a class name and what i want to do is to just change the text color of to do app so i will change the color to blue which is given by text primary So I will save the app.js and then go to our browser and wait for it to refresh. So the text color have changed to blue, meaning that Bootstrap is now working. We will be using Bootstrap to style all our components. So I will see you in the next video where we will be adding React routing uh, in our application and also add several components.